Hi guys, it's AJ Zoe Eve back again with another opening video. This time it's Marisol. She came back from the doll hospital. I just sliced the box open and left it in this in our guest room just so I could open it for you guys. So it comes with the receipt, which I'm not going to show. There's the box. It's just pretty cool. I was kind of hoping to get one of these boxes at some point because I think they're pretty cool. And so this is what it looks like. It's just white. I'm sure you guys have seen it before with a little band-aid. This is American Girl Doll Hospital. There she is. There's Marisol. And she comes with a little get well card. And it says, get well soon, from your friends at American Girl. That's really cute. She's looped in just like the regular dolls are, secure. And here she is, looking really cute. And the only other thing is, there is a certificate of good health. It says, I hereby certify that Marisol Luna is now ready to return home and resume all regular activities slowly. I prescribe plenty of rest for one week plus an extra strength dose of TLC, tender loving care to be administered at least twice daily. Dr. Ben. So that's cute. So I'll put this aside. But I had, just so you know, I got Marisol from a friend and she had her pleasant company head before. And so I, with what was left of my gift card, since my sister bought me so many things, I went ahead and sent Marisol to the doll hospital. Originally, I was only going to replace her head, but I decided to go ahead and replace her limbs as well because on the bottom of her foot, it, it was like a little bit scratched and it was bothering me. And even though the woman, when I went there in New York, they were so nice, you shouldn't probably waste your money on the limbs, but after she got to know me, she knew that. <laughs> It would bother me so I thought that was pretty funny and it comes she comes with her little American Girl doll hospital ID bracelet which that's pretty cute nice touch and then the socks have a little heart on the bottom just want to take them off so that I can check her out completely and they also told me that if you replace one limb they match the other so if you have a pleasant company limb they won't put one limb that doesn't match so I guess they must have a fair supply but her torso is still the same because I wanted to make sure that her torso was not replaced because I love the... I'm just going to take off her nightgown. I love that she's flat here and that there's not a lot of puckering here on the neckline. So I can tell that it is the same. They didn't change her body. But it is a new head. It says American Girl. And her hair definitely looks different. And they put pink scrunchies in her. And they gave her some pigtails. And when I brought her to the doll hospital, they told me that more than likely it looked like her hair had been blow dried or like flat ironed or something. So I guess they can tell if it's been something's been done to it. I have no idea. But it's definitely curlier and a little bit thicker. I think the other wig was just a tiny bit thinner. But she's adorable. So pretty. I'm so excited. And her limbs are super tight. And she's great. Look at that super tight limbs and she looks awesome 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 so I'm excited to get her dressed and give her a little extra TLC but so I highly recommend the doll hospital this is my first experience with it I got the doll back I dropped her off at the New York store and I got her back within two weeks and they gave me a receipt I had no issue and she's perfect she looks fantastic so anyway thanks so much for watching <laughs> Bye.